Hey guys, welcome back to our channel, Accounts Guru Cool. Learn accounting online. So today we are here with one more video, and uh, in this video we are going to discuss about one of the job profiles which are there on the Nokri.coms, and this is related to the team lead for record to report for US SIPs and hiring for Jenny AI. And the experience is required from five to 10 years. And the package is around eight lakh to 15 lakh per annum. And this job was open six days ago. And as of now, around 1,280 applications was there. But we are going to discuss this job descriptions in details, what the roles and responsibilities ask for this profile when the employer is going to offer you around 8 to 15 lakh per annum and this profile is related to the team lead from record to report then what are all the responsibilities are there and uh, what we have to understood from that and how the questions interview are going to ask about that so that's essential for us to know if we are planning into do the transition into the r2r or we are trying to do the change or into R to R from any other domain or from any other profile, or if you are executive and if you are trying to go into the uh, apply for team lead, then what job skill set, what job descriptions and roles and responsibilities are there, and related to that, what you have to acquire the more skill which you have to enhance to go for such kind of profile so that's all we are going to discuss in this video so request viewers to watch the video till the end like the video join with us share the video and subscribe our channel to get the more practical knowledge related to accounting and finance in addition to that if you need any specific training then you can reach to us on our email id that's accounts.grukul.com now here related to these roles and responsibility and if you see the first responsibilities are there the client facing work closely with startup founders to ensure the impact of businesses transactions are properly stated so this profile is related to you have to work with the startup founders so most of the startups are there and related to them you have to work with them to ensure the business transactions are properly stated and uh, you have to support to them for all these initial phase the next is related to embarrass and enjoy working with a new technology powered by ai so here you have to ensure that this is going to be talk about the artificial intelligence so the way we have created the videos related to the uh, how the automation is going into the accounting and finance black line also is there cryptocurrency also is a new concept is there in addition to that artificial intelligence also is there machine learning that's a rpe that machine learning also is required and cutting edge automations so the startups guys are more do the focus towards the automation side they are uh tech uh technical export related to tech we team and uh, they have a lot of interest into technology or automations so considering that in this profile you should be enjoy working with the new technology that's a power by artificial intelligence machine learning and whatever the automations are going to be do that you have to be aware about that and you are going to enjoy working for that with that automations now the next is going to be related to train and mentor staff and senior level accountants knowing that you are going to hire for the team lead that's a record to report and its expectation from you your your aid is related to train and mentor staff and senior level accountants so whatever the teams are there is your responsibility to train and you should be mentor them for r to r profile so here how it's going to work Knowing that you are the team lead, so you have the more expertise related to all the R2R R functions and whatever the skill set you have, you have to be give the training and you have to be there as a mentor for your entire staff. So related to that, there are questions are going to become how you are going to be give the training, how you have the experience related to training and how you are going to be mentor for your senior level accountants. So there are a number of questions are going to be 
come towards the how you are going to handle the team for this jobs and responsibilities now the next one is ensure investor reporting and debt convenient are reporting accurately and timely so you have to be ensure the investor reporting requirements knowing that this these are all these are all the startups and uh, they you should do the startups through the funding from the investors and uh, there are a number of reporting structures are required for the investors so you should be the well versed with that and you have to be aware about that and to ensure you are doing the timely reporting to your uh, investors whatever as per their requirements and debt convenience are reporting accurately and timely now the next one is related to review partner affiliate sales and vendor contracts for proper applications of accounting pronouncements so related to the partner and affiliate sales and vendor contracts so wherever there is a vendors are there you are going to be into the sales related to the ar or uh, o2c or p2p so wherever you are going to do the any contract with this your customers and if you are doing the contract with your vendors then you should be the well versed with that and you have to be ensure that all the contracts are in place and that you have to be review and the proper application of accounting pronouncements are applicable for that that all you have to be ensure about the review of partner affiliate and sales and vendor contracts for proper applications of accounting and pronouncement now the next skill or roles and responsibilities required is that manage multiple clients at varying stages pre revenue post revenue so knowing that this profile is going to be you have to be closely work with the, all the startups so there might be you are going to be handle the more than one client at a time and uh, you are going to be support for pre revenue and post revenue scenario where the startups are there initial for one and one year two years as per the revenue models plan they are going to just doing the investment for that and uh, that's a pre revenue stage and once they start the revenue generations and when their models are into revenue generation then it's going to be start as a post revenue model so you are going to be work in such scenario where the revenue is not there then how you are going to be work what are the skill sets are required for that how you are managing the expenses and since you are this this kind of startups are already funded through the investors so it's essential for you to have a track of each and every expenses to ensure how we are spending the investors amount so that's and when you are going to be start into post revenue models then also you need to keep a track about that how it's going to be and how it's going to be work that's all related to the whatever the skill sets are required for that it's essential for you to have the skill set for that as well and the next one is related to the jobs and uh, responsibilities of related to your knowledge of equity recons and other balance sheet schedules so wherever the equity reconstitutions are required and other than that balance sheet schedules are we ha you have to prepare so the knowledge you are going to be joined there as a team lead so your downline team should be well versed with all these things but you you should be have a knowledge because you are the team lead and going to review of all these things so the balance sheet schedules and equity recon also is required into the uh, your knowledge skill set now coming back to the next is related to related to the next one what is going to be required for here is that perform pnl pnl trading analysis so you you should be able to do the pn profit and loss trading analysis says that how much is the last month's uh, numbers how much is this current month numbers what's the analysis for the future and how the profit and loss is going from the expense sides that all analysis you need to do and uh, you have to have that skill with you for doing the pnl trading analysis for each and every expense spend what we we have expense of for that you have to do the analysis for that in addition to a uh, review and uh, perform full cycle of month end close and reporting so in addition to pnl trading and analysis training and uh, trending and analysis you have to review and perform the full cycle of month end close and reporting so wherever you have to do the month end closing so related to that whatever the closing checks are required when you are the going to do the closure of the month 
related to giving example of either the provision has been created into the books, deferred revenue is there, or whatever the prepaid to expense of have you done. In addition to that, if any expenses are incorrectly booked, you have to do the value. You have to review for that. And uh, you have to ensure whatever the numbers are reflecting into the profit and loss and balance sheets are correct. Wherever the reconciliations are required related to the balance sheet, that should be the, in the place. So that's all you have to do. And uh, if any unbilled revenues are there, then you have to book the unbilled revenue into the systems. And as and when it's booked, you have to do the reclassification from the balance sheet to the PNL. So that you have to do all these things. If you have any foreign currency balances, you have to reinstate that balances as per the foreign exchange rate, and you have to take the impact of that into the books. So that's all you are going to do when you are the performing the full cycle month in close and whatever the reportings are there as per the structures, either investors ask any reporting or you are going to do any MIS preparations at your end. So that all review you have to do from your end being you are the lead for this role. Now, in addition to that, review and confirm the transactions for accuracy and completeness. This is also the one going to be in a parallel of the month end close and reporting. So when you are going to do the review of month end close and reporting, whatever the prepare in the place. So for that, you have to do review and you have to confirm the transitions of for accuracy and completeness. Being you are the lead of this profile and you are going to submit your MIS or present your numbers to the management or the startup stakeholders, directors. So to them, the confidence what is required from your aid related to what you are presenting should going to be create a magic for you. So whatever the numbers are there into the balance sheet PNL, you should be the well boss with that. You have the hold on that. You have the backup for that. And you have to, you have also ensure the accuracy and completeness of accounting. Now, accuracy says that whatever the transaction has been entered into the systems, you have to get a hold on that. There should not be any errors. Knowing that, giving some examples is like that if the GST should be recoverable, then that should be the part into the GST input credit. And if any expenses at the time of purchasing the fixed assets are there, then you have to do the capitalization of that. And if any prepared expenses are there, but due to some uh, lack of visibility and the team book into the uh, P&L as expenses, but instead of considering the duration for that and haven't reclassified to the balance sheets as a prepaid expense, then you have to do the analysis, you have to get the hold on that, you have to ensure the accuracy for that. So that's all are going to be part of your review and con review and confirm the transactions for the accuracy. And from the completeness standpoint, one of the expenses has been incurred, either related to that expenses, either the all transaction has been booked, or if it's not, whatever the relevant provisions are acquired, either that's in place. If it's not, then you have to record the provision into the books. So that's all are going to be part of your review and confirm transactions for accuracy and completeness, knowing that you are the lead. So you have to ensure all these things. Now the next related to uh, be proactive when approaching, anticipating and resolving client request. So very interesting. So it means that you have to be take a proactive step instead of your vendors or your customers, or you can say the vendor instead of vendor, vendor or customers, your the stakeholders from the reporting standpoint, from the start of uh, director founder standpoint. So you have to be yourself as a proactive to give the uh, details to, <laughs> sorry, details to your uh, managers, to your client, and you have to be proactively when approaching, anticipating, and resolving client requests. So whenever there is any request from the client, so you have to ensure the TAT for that. That's a turnaround time. Or uh, service level agreement should be there in the place related to SLA in how many durations, how many hours, how many days you guys are going to test to do the reward for that. So that's all going to be in this job profile. Now the next one is related to team player that collaborate with the helps of those whenever or wherever needed. So knowing that, again, you are the team player, the team is going to be looked towards you. So you should be available for the team and you are going to be there to help others whenever or wherever needed. So the sentence is very essential should know. Whenever the team is required any help, you are there to support to them whenever and wherever. So there is no any limitations for whenever and wherever. 
So as and when team need help, you should be there to support to them. That's all the job responsibilities related to this team lead record to report. Now coming back to how it's going to be, how a desired candidate for this profile is that bachelor degree in accounting or finance require seven to nine years of applicable experience required. CA, CPA, CMA, MBA, accounting or finance concentrations preferred. Five plus years of direct experience working in high tech startup preferred completing full cycle monthly clues and reporting. Big four accounting experience is going to be added benefit. Strong knowledge and application of US CAP required in the areas of SaaS accounting. Revenue, recognitions, consolidations, and deliverables. So very essential to know that this is a SaaS accounting, revenue recognition, and consolidations, and convertible debt. So that's that's very essential, the skill when you are going to or looking towards the startup to join any startup. Now, Related to the next ability to interpret and apply PCC pr pronouncement and guidelines, experience completing and or preparing records or due diligence and or external audits. Knowing that you are the startups and it's funded by the investors, so due diligence are going to be there as and when the new investors are going to do the investments or any external audit also is applicable based on the investors, what they ask us to do audit from the external audits or from the big fours. Next one is related to experience implementing and maintaining QuickBooks online, expensive five, build.com, Gusto, including system integrations. So these are all the skill when the startups are there, most of the startups do the accounting into the QuickBooks is related to QuickBooks online, expensive five, build.com, Gusto, including system integration. So the one more thing to uh, have a brief update to or keep update to our viewers is that we used to conduct the QuickBook online classes for this QuickBook software. Also, we have the classes related to expensive five as well, build.com and Gusto as well. So we used to take the, all the classes related to this software. So if anyone need, you can reach to us to have more visibility about all these softwares and when you are looking towards the uh, startups most of the startups are using the quickbooks online so it's essential for you to have a skill when this employer is going to be how the offer for eight to 12 lakh per annum and the expectation of the accounting software is here is instead of erp it's a quickbooks online and expensify is going to be for the reports and build.com and gusto gusto is from the payroll standpoints including system integrations strong communication skills and oral and return must be this is a mandatory strong time priority and management management skills using ms office that's a suit google suit doc seats require immediate joiners are going to be preferred and shift is us so most probably that's going to be night sip. So other than that, if anything more in this, wait. Okay. Rule finance and accounting, other fine tech payment and rule finance accounting. So that's related to now the key skills. So one thing is very interesting to know. The revenue recognitions, balance sheet, bank reconciliations, US cap, record to report cap, accounting, R2R, general ledger, IFRS, GL accounting, and cash flow statements. These are all going to be the key skills is required for this profile. So that's all from this video, guys. So we have discussed there is a one opening related to the team lead record to report R2R US SIPs and the, uh, the job. The offer is around the salary is around 8 lakh to 15 lakh per annum. And we know what the roles and responsibilities are there. So we have discussed in detail about that roles and responsibilities in a few line items where the probable questions are going to be asked. So that's all from this video. And if you are uh, looking such kind of roles and responsibilities or any lead, so you should be ready with the, uh, these all are all the roles and responsibilities and related to that. What are the skill sets I acquire? You have to acquire. And uh, for that, if any help is required from our end, then that's most welcome. And you can reach us on our official email ID. That's accounts.gurukul.com. Accounts.gurukul at the rate yahoo.com. 
to have any discussions on such kind of profiles uh, to go through with any training. Thanks guys for watching the video till the end and uh, request to like the video, share the video, join with us and subscribe our channel to get the more practical knowledge related to accounting and finance. Thank you.